has already received noise complaints since work began in the M. of sun and cloud with a chance. In night mode, the display is off so that the bedroom is darker. If I want to check the time, I touch the capacitive touch bar at the top. It shows the time for five seconds and then goes out again. Once it says CFG in the display of your clock, you go to your network control panel and it will show you the networks that are available to you. You pick the access point, the radio AP. Once you have selected the access point, the browser will open on your device and you can now go to configure Wi-Fi. And if I see my network, I can click on it and put in my password or I can type in the network ID and the network password. I can configure my hotspot name from my phone and my hotspot password if I want to be able to use my clock radio with my phone when I'm traveling or doing demonstrations. Then I can configure nighttime and daytime mode. Nighttime display off means that at the specified hour, in this case 9 p.m., which is 2100 in 24 hour time, it will turn the display off so that during nighttime the display is off and it helps the room stay dark. If I want to check the time during the night, I just reach over and touch the touch wire on top of the clock and it will put the display on for five seconds so I can see the time and then it'll turn the display off again. And then at 6 a.m. we'll go back into daytime mode and the display will be on all day until the next uh, nighttime hour occurs. I can set my station IDs and my station URLs. The station IDs can be numbers if it's like an on-air station, or it can be a combination of letters and numbers as long as those letters and numbers can be rep represented in a seven segment display. I have room for up to 10 stations that I can store. Once I've got all those set, as long as I have put in a valid network ID and password, I will click the save button and the ESP Wi-Fi manager will save all those credentials and all those settings to the clock radio. I just recycle the power on the radio. The clock radio will power up. It will search for a network clock. It will sync the time, get the time from the network clock, and then the clock is in operational mode. With the radio configured, powered up, We get the indication that it is syncing to the internet clock server. It then shows the wake radio station, the wake time, and then the current time, and it is now operational. Thank you.